Okay, now we're going to do the rubberized cork handle. Completely rubberized cork. There's natural cork in there, but the whole handle has rubberized in it. I like to take a little more time with this just to make sure that we're clearing out because it has a high content of rubber. So I like to just take my time, make sure that we're clearing everything out so we don't get any binding, no heating up. Could see the spark and the particulate are cleared right out right away. And there we go. Beautiful hole right down the middle. No time at all. So now we have our 80 density EVA, quite a bit hard just to show what we can do. And that's it. Quick as that. So, depending on what size you want, two, three, you know, 10, 20 seconds total, you're there. This is a bit softer. This is a 40. Straight through right down the middle nice and quick so now when we're cleaning the brushes I showed you earlier um, I like to use a it's a little soft kind of cleaning metal cleaning brush not too hard won't hurt the reamer but we've built everything up on here from rubberized cork in the teeth to plain cork now to EVA and all we got to do basically give them a little rub and for the lack of for the lack of uh, showing the camera, there we are. We're all clean. Just a little scrub, and I'm not scrubbing hard. I'm just cleaning out the teeth, giving them a little brush. You can do the same with the copper. It does the same thing. These brushes just don't last a little bit as long, but as you can see. reamers clean and that's basically about it folks that's why it's called the ultimate reamer thanks for taking the time